اهلا و سهلا بكم مرحبا بكم مرة أخرى في شين يوتيوب متاعنا اي في اكاديمي القناة التعليمية الموجهة لسنوي الاعدادي والثانوي آه اليوم درسنا في اللغة الانجليزية بش يكون على present perfect tense ودرس موجه من آه تلاميذة نفير عني والبخمي غاني سوف so في نفير عني you have seen the uh, simple present simple past Present progressive and past progressive. خمس خثين أو ثلاثة شو تشوفوا present perfect. So let's get it started. Present perfect rules and uses. How do you form the present perfect? منش متكون. The present perfect tense is formed by using have or has. Plus past participle of the main verb. So we use have with personal pronoun I, we, they, and you. We use has with singular pronoun pronouns uh, like he, she, and it. Let's see an example. I have seen that movie. Another example. She has seen that movie. Let's move on to the forms of the sentences. We have three forms, positive, negative, and questions. <clears throat> positive form, il hiya affirmative sentence. What is the rule? Subject plus have or has plus past participle of the main verb. I have eaten sushi before. They have seen that movie. He hasn't been to Japan. Negative form. The rule says subject plus haven't or hasn't plus past participle of the main verb. So here we insert in negation. We added not to have or has so it becomes i haven't or i have not eaten sushi before this is the long form the short form i haven't eaten they haven't seen he hasn't been so both are correct i have not eaten sushi before or i haven't eaten sushi before let's move on to the questions the rules have or has plus subject plus ever plus past participle example have you ever eaten sushi before have they ever seen that movie has he ever been to japan so here amalna reverse في العادة الجملة تبدأ ب subject في ال question نحط ال have or has ومن بعد ندخلو ال subject so نشوفو في ال positive form I have eaten في ال question have you ever eaten sushi before so this is the difference now Let's move on to the uses. Alish, Nistamu, present perfect, Waktish, Nistamu. The present perfect tells us about something that occurred at some indefinite period in the past. Donc, le present perfect هو حدث صار في وقت غير معلوم في الماضي ومتواصل للحاضر. So, here, عنا السلم الزمني. لهني بداية الحدث action started ومتواصلة حتى the moment of speaking دونك ال present perfect ينجم يكون صار لهنا 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 في أي نقطة من المكان هذا so هو حدث بدء من الماضي متواصل للحاضر 
We also use this tense when we want to talk about unfinished actions or states or habits that started in the past and continue to the present. Usually, we use it to say how long and we need since or for. So, نحكي على أحداث زالت متواصلة موفيتش. So, هذا هو الفرق بين present perfect and simple past. The simple past, an action began and ended in the simple past. حدث بدي وهي في الماضي. Whereas the present perfect, the action started in the past and still uh, going on till the moment of speaking, which means till the present. Let's see an example. He's had that car since he was in high school. So he is in a short form. He has had. So the verb to have in the present perfect only has had. So the present perfect is from has or have with the participation of the verb. So we use has and the participation of the verb to have he had. So he has had that car since he was in high school. So here عنده الشخص هذا يملك السيارة دونك شريها من اللي هو كان في الهاي سكول شنو نفهمو هنا ان الشخص هذا مازال متواجد على قيد الحياة و... والسيارة اللي يستخدم فيها عندها مدة من اللي هو كان يقرأ another example with four we've known each other for our whole lives but We've only been friends since 2006. معنى الجملة اللي نعرفو بعضنا ملي <hesitation> حياتنا كاملة، لكن ما ولينا أصحاب كان منذ بداية ألفين وستة. So لهنا we've known عنا present perfect have known. So, استعملنا verb to know صرفنا في present perfect. We've known each other for our whole lives, but we've only been friends. هنا مرة أخرى عودنا است استعملنا the present perfect verb to be in the present perfect اللي هو let have been. So لهنا with اللي هي we have مع ال participation تا verb to be اللي هي been another example I've worked here for six months donc verb to work participation تا verb to work worked and have We use this task to talk about finished actions, like experience, for, for instance. These are actions or events that happen sometime during a person's life. We don't say when the experience happened and the person needs to be alive now. We often use the words ever and never here. So, shufna qbal. نستعمل present perfect for unfinished actions أحديث مازالت متواصلة كذلك نستعمل present perfect في finished actions أحديث وفات دونك uh, finished actions لكن بينسور فما دي كونديسيون باش نستعملو ال present perfect هي اللي هي وقت اللي باش نحكيو على life experience اوكي okay. And uh, recent actions also. Let's see an example. Have you ever been to Tokyo? So here, نحكي على experience. عمرك شي مشيت لل Tokyo. عمرك شي جربت الماكلة هذيك. كي بس نحكي على experiences 
demands them to the present perfect tense. They have visited Paris three times. So here, the present perfect is on the result of the actions. Here, on the same time, we talk about the experience and we focus on the result of the action. So, I went to Paris three times. I talked about the travel. لكن النتيجة اللي هي سافرت أو سافروا لباريس ثلاثة مرات. Another example: We have never seen that movie or that film. So لن نحكي على الاكسبيرينس إذا كان موجودة وإلا غير موجودة. So استعملنا في positive form واستعملنا في negative form. So حاجة عملتها وحاجة عمرك ما عملتها. Another use of the present perfect tense. We use this tense to talk about something that happened recently, even if there isn't a clear result in the present. This is common when we want to introduce news and we often use the words just, yet, already, and recently. So, كذلك نستعمل present perfect في أحد متهية لكنها مازال طوى طوى كي صارت. Let's see an example. I have just finished my homework. مازال كيف كملت الهومورك نتاعي. She has already called him. The mayor has announced a new plan for the railways. So, this is the end of our lesson. To sum up, let's uh, recap. وقتاش نستعملو present perfect؟ نستعملو كي باش نحكيو على finished actions. أحداث صارت وانتهيت. وقتاش؟ وقت اللي باش نحكيو على life experiences. باش نحكيو على experience. Uh, experiences that happened or things that you haven't done yet. We also use the present perfect with recent actions. Hajit sarat mandhish mudatila. We use it also to talk about unfinished actions. Ahdith mazalat mutwasla. Hajat ibdi min al mafi mutwasla al hada. Another example: I have lost my keys. Zayat limfet hamtak. Najm ko inti zayat limfet hamtak. Andak. نهار عندك ساعتين ومازال الطاو ضايعين so حدث الضياع مازال متواصل so we use the present perfect tense I have lost my keys I hope this lesson was clear enough for more videos please subscribe to our channel at youtube slash lviaacademy.com you can also visit us at our platform for more lessons and resume at www.lvia-academy.com.